Next we have Patrick with Neuropos, and he is bringing the power of the human brain to artificial intelligence. Okay, who's seen the movies Terminator, The Matrix, or iRobot? All right, what do these movies have in common? Robots get so smart that they take over the world, right? Okay, who's heard of ChatGPT and is worried that ChatGPT is gonna be the next Skynet? That's awesome, I've got great news for you because Neurofos is here to bring Skynet to a neighborhood near you. I'm just kidding, we would never actually make human-eating robots, but we are here to bring the power of the human brain to artificial intelligence. See, the most fundamental barrier to AI is actually energy, because it turns out that data centers already contribute as much greenhouse gases as the entire airline industry, and they're under exponential demand for energy from AI. Now the reason why AI burns so much power is because it's ultimately a simulation of a brain. And what you would really like to have is a brain, because the human brain burns about 10,000 times less energy than a modern day processor. Now a brain is like this crazy complex three-dimensional structure, but it turns out that light is a really convenient way to essentially hook up all the neurons, and Neurofos has figured out how to use a technology called metamaterials, which was used to make the first invisibility cloak, and I worked on it in my PhD, to do exactly that. Make a brain using light with more than 200 times less power consumption. I love brains, I love AI, I love physics, and I love invisibility cloaks, and I love the movie The Matrix. Please feel free to talk to me about any of these things.